I am part of the annual 9-11 Memorial 5K Run Walk and Community Day. In April 2009, Barack Obama signed a law into action stating that September 11th would be a day of service. So we honor that each April with our annual 5K Run Walk. How we found Run Sign Up was back in 2017. Our production company recommended potentially looking what was out there. I would say we went through about four or five different platforms before finally landing on Run Sign Up. It literally checked any box that we would have wanted. It was free for us to use as a nonprofit. We don't really have the funds to put back into a race platform. It also integrated the registration and the fundraising page, and it provided great incentives for our participants, such as the store. Even going through all the rest of these other platforms, they just don't have all of these capabilities that Run Sign Up is able to offer. We track all of our fundraising participants through Run Sign Up directly. Our top fundraising program, we offer incentives at the 25, 50, 100, and 250 level. Those are smaller items like hats or smart wallets, lanyards, whatever offering we're giving that year. But at that $500 level, you're able to access our VIP lounges, both at the finish and the start line. We're in April, it's a little cold, so having heat at near the start line is a great benefit to folks. And at the finish line this past year, we offered foot massages, back massages, Eataly offered free bites, a local company called Gloveworks offered cool downs. It's something that if you're not in it that year, folks ask us how they can get in it, so it really ups our fundraising numbers. Since we switched to Run Sign Up three years ago, we have more than tripled our donations each year, bringing in about 10 to 15 k more than the year before. The 9 11 Memorial 5K has been able to raise more through the integration of the fundraising to donation step. Having a cause really helps as well. People love to know where their money is going to, and the fact that we actually don't pay any processing fees really helps us that every dollar is actually given to the 9 11 Memorial Museum, and we don't have to take any of that profits elsewhere. I would also say that a really great function to run sign up is the charitable donation at the very end where you're able to ask participants just in case they might have forgotten during the donation stage to add a little bit extra so making sure you have that as part of your race definitely helps raise more money as well in this current moment my favorite feature by far is honestly the reporting feature it makes my life so much easier when we need some concrete piece of data going from year to year. Having all this information is easily sortable in one place and being able to pull reports with whatever data we might need, whether it's gender, heat map, or anything of that nature, it's just amazing to be able to pull that all in one location. I would say a great feature that I don't know as many races take advantage of is the store. We love using our store. It allows us to sell quote unquote limited merchandise that you're not able to get anywhere else. I actually get a lot of questions of folks asking me, will they be able to buy the stuff that's in our store on race day? And unfortunately we're not able to provide it, but it gives that incentive and that limitability that really drives our store. All of the advantages of using Run Sign Up as an all-in-one registration and fundraising platform is the main reason why the memorial actually moved our registration platform to Run Sign Up about three years ago. Before we found it was very hard for our participants to go through a registration platform and a fundraising platform. So when hunting for a new platform, Run Sign Up checked all of our boxes perfectly. So it's, it's a very easy integration for our users to be able to register and fundraise all in one platform. Thank you.